Hong Kong is hosting a special exhibition for dogs. The 3D sculptures, abstract art displays and digitized artwork have all been displayed at dog eye level for an immersive experience for the four-legged companions. Here's a report. Hong Kong is offering a personalized cultural experience for its furry friends. A special exhibition for dogs, replete with abstract art, 3D dog sculptures and digitized artwork. See that chihuahua sniffing and inspecting a picture of a pit bull? All artworks have been set up at the dog's eye level for a convenient walkthrough of the gallery. And there we have Pee Pee admiring all the images from the convenience of her human's arms. Pee Pee is still quite young. Its sense of smell is relatively more sensitive than vision. We have taken Pee Pee to see some artworks on other occasions, but here I think we are having fun with Pee Pee more than appreciating the art seriously. Hong Kong doesn't have a lot of places that allow pets. And so, a gallery like this is not just a modern-day kitsch, but an opportunity for residents to bond and spend some time with their pets. Me and my dog are having such a new experience by joining this event together, which we never had before. Apart from bringing them to the park, it would be great if we can take them to different places, such as shopping malls, like here, where there is crowd, and it would be a good opportunity for them to learn to how to behave. The images here are by American artist Mitchell Keck, illustrating a variety of dog breeds. Art psychotherapists believe that an experience like this may be significantly beneficial for the mental health of the pet owners and visitors. As an art psychotherapist, I think um, maybe look at arts or making arts together with your pets can definitely benefit to your mental health because we have a ability that is a pleasure theory. So this is our instinct, ability to, to look at some beautiful things. For example, I put on this dress because it looks fits me. And when, when we look at art together with our pets, so for us, it's a building new experiences and creating the, the bonding and maybe empowering us from many things we cannot do, but in somehow that we can create new memory with our pets. The dog art gallery, open till the end of August, proved to be a hit among dog owners and lovers. And if they were to become a thing, walks to the park may soon be passé. Bureau Report, we on, World is One.